compartment syndrome causes in treatment. Just as in shin splints, the repetitive overuse can cause the muscles and surrounding tissues to swell. If the muscle becomes too big for the surrounding fascia and increases the compartmental pressure, it's called anterior compartment syndrome. When the swelling and pressure from muscular damage and irritation from shin splints continue and build inside the anterior compartment, the pressure may become greater than the blood pressure, keeping tiny capillaries supplying blood to the muscles in the compartment open. In this event, the capillaries are squeezed in a manner that inhibits blood supply to the muscle tissues. This can cause the muscle to ache and cramp at first, but as the pressure continues to rise, it can squeeze larger blood vessels and nerves. This can cause the leg and foot areas under the compartment to feel cold and numb, swell, and hurt. The following symptoms of anterior compartment syndrome distinguish it from shin splints. Coldness in the lower leg and foot. The distal lower extremity may change color, usually a pale bluish tint. There may be severe dorsiflexion motor function impairment, and the lower leg and foot may feel numb or dead. Acute stage symptoms are characterized by swelling, redness, pain, and possibly a local sensation of heat, indicating inflammation. If coolness makes your pain feel better, then the acute stage treatment is recommended. Apply the sinew herbal ice on your leg to reduce redness, swelling, and inflammation while dispersing accumulated blood and fluids to help restore normal circulation to the leg. This first aid treatment is used in place of ice to significantly speed up the healing process. It reduces the swelling and inflammation more effectively than ice, allowing you to more quickly regain range of motion. Ice is not recommended because it does not help repair damaged tissues and keeps everything in the injured area frozen, causing the stagnation of blood and fluids and the contraction of muscles, tendons, and ligaments. In Chinese sports medicine, ice is not used and is considered a culprit in injuries that don't heal well. Massage your leg with acute sinew liniment to relieve pain, reduce swelling and inflammation, break up clotted blood in stagnant fluids, and stimulate circulation of blood and fluids to help cells quickly repair damaged tissues. The Sinew Sports Massage Oil is recommended for use before and after exercise, sports, and strenuous activity. It warms and stimulates your muscles, increases circulation, and relieves tightness, hence improving your performance and helping to prevent injury. Chronic stage symptoms begin once the swelling and inflammation are gone, but you still feel pain, stiffness, weakness, and or sensitivity in cold and damp weather. If heat makes your pain feel better, then the chronic stage treatment is recommended. Massage your leg with chronic sinew liniment to relieve pain and stiffness, strongly stimulate circulation and blood flow to damaged tissues, and promote the healing of overstretched tendons and ligaments. Soak your leg with the sinew relaxing soak to relax muscles and tendons that are in spasm, ease joint pain and stiffness, and improve range of motion. The sinew relaxing soak is particularly useful if you feel restricted mobility in your leg. The soak can be used by saturating a towel in the liquid and applying it to your leg. The sinew sports massage oil is recommended for use before and after exercise, sports, and strenuous activity. It warms and stimulates your muscles, increases circulation, and relieves tightness, hence improving your performance and helping to prevent injury. Thank you for watching. For more videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel. To learn more, visit sinewtherapeutics.com.